guys, what's up? Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Gracie. If you guys are new here, hi. Um, I am just going to be filming a day in my life today sort of video. I haven't really filmed a video like this in a really long time, so I wanted to film another one. I talked about in my last video that I wanted to post a bunch of Disney videos, and I still want to continue posting videos that are centered around Disney, but I'm also not living in Orlando or I'm not able to go to Disney whenever I want anymore. So I wanted to film some more realistic videos like this one, like a day in my life as a college student. I'm here with Hannah. Hello. This is my roommate. You guys should all know her if you've been following me for a while. You guys kind of saw my morning montage of things I was doing this morning, but I got ready a couple minutes ago and I actually have class in like about 50 minutes. So I wanted to go ahead and make something for lunch because I'm hungry. I'm starting this like diet today kind of because I'm in my friend Jenna's wedding in January and so I want to lose a couple pounds before the wedding. The diet that I'm starting, basically I'm like intermittent fasting so I can only eat between like 12 and eight. But I mean obviously it's, if it's eight o'clock and I haven't eaten dinner yet I'm and I'm starving, like I'm gonna let myself eat dinner. Like I'm not like gonna be super strict about it in that way but I do want to like try and follow it as best as I can. But so I'm making my lunch right now. I think I'm gonna make a salad if my lettuce is good. It might not be good. If not, then I don't know what I'm gonna eat. Chopping up my lettuce a little bit. Throwing it in the bowl. Yeah, this is a small salad. But I got my lettuce. I'm gonna be adding some tuna. Um, some diced red onion, some goat cheese. I'm obsessed with goat cheese right now for some reason. We have it at work, and so I think that's why I like it so much because I eat it pretty often there. Um, so I've got some goat cheese, and then I'm also going to eat some rainbow baby carrots that I got. So I'm just gonna make this salad, and then I guess I'll show you guys after. Okay guys, I finished up my salad. Doesn't it look good? So I ended up just adding the tuna and the goat cheese on top. Yeah, I added everything to the salad, and I'm going to eat this. It's a pretty, I mean, it's pretty big, but not huge. And I'm going to eat what's left in this raspberry container. Um, I need to eat up all those raspberries I have before they go bad. But I'm going to eat this for lunch. Talk to my Hannah girl. So I also decided not to go to my class today because I just don't want to, honestly. So I'll try and be productive in other ways since I'm not going to class. I really need to do... All that laundry that's sitting on my bed, I need to fold and hang up. And then I have some more laundry in the dryer that I just moved over last night that I need to fold and hang up. Um, and yeah, tonight I have rehearsal because I lead worship at my church on Sunday mornings. So I have rehearsal for that tonight. So really, that's the only thing I have planned for today. Oh, and I really want to go to the grocery store because, like I said, I'm starting this new diet. So I want to have some, I don't know, stuff. To eat I guess stuff to make and I ran out of lettuce salads are my all-time favorite thing to eat even when I'm like not on a diet not my all-time favorite thing to eat but I really enjoy salads um and I need to buy some more chicken that I can make and grill up to add to the salads and I might add some more stuff I want to look up some like healthy recipes that I can make because I'm not going to want to just eat salads every single day for every single meal so I'm gonna look that up I'm just about to sit down and eat this um and then I'll probably work on some homework. So kind of a somewhat eventful day, but I'm just really happy with my decision to not go to class, so. <laughs> okay guys, I just folded up my laundry. I kind of just folded my t-shirts randomly. I kind of struggle with how to fold my t-shirts because some of them I fold them in like squares, but as you can see, like this drawer is just like so messy. So I want to kind of like reorganize this. I just have way too many t-shirts that I know what to do with. Cause like even those aren't going to fit in there and I still have so many more t-shirts to fold up nice. So I'm just gonna start putting these t-shirts in here. And I ended up putting my socks and like underwear and stuff into this little bin because my sock drawer is full. And I need to go through that as well because I know I like hardly wear any of the stuff that's in there. So these are the socks and tank tops and bras and stuff that I know that I wear. So I'm going to start filling this bin up 
so that I have as little as possible and that I know I use all of this stuff in this bin. I just sort of finished doing my laundry. I still have a little bit more to fold and put up, but I wanted to go ahead and go to the grocery store. I've just been listening to a couple of different podcasts while I've been folding my laundry and cleaning up my room a little bit. So that's been nice. I'm a big podcast girl these days. I really have been liking listening to, I've always been a fan of David's vlog, um, like of David's vlog on YouTube. And I actually met David and Jason on their podcast tour. So I've been listening to views the podcast with David and Jason since like my junior year of high school, like a long, long, long time. Um, and then I also listened to Zane and Heath's podcast from the vlog squad. And I also listened to Matt and Mike's podcast from the vlog squad. So those are a bunch of vlog squad podcasts I like to listen to. Also listen to a couple different Disney podcasts. Um, one of my best friends, Glenn, he has a podcast called Not So Small World and I really like listening to his podcast. Go search it on Apple Podcasts or Spotify because I really like his podcast. He also has some videos posted on YouTube where he like videos his podcast recording. Um, I listen to the Capture the Magic Network podcast. So Capture the Magic, Diz Dudes, Main Street Magic, um, Drip Tales. I listen to all of those podcasts. And then I listen to some Christian podcasts. I listen to The Porch, um, The Morning Toast, The Snatch Lure. I literally listen to so many podcasts. It's insane. Don't mind me. I changed my shirt because it is hot outside and I didn't want to wear that striped shirt that I had on under but it is literally so hot outside y'all it's raining right now I don't know if you can tell but it is raining and I don't think I have an umbrella in here yeah I don't think I have an umbrella in here so that kind of sucks so let's just pray that it doesn't rain on me while I am walking in and out of these stores let's pray that the rain lets up but yeah it is literally so hot guys last week it was like 50 to 60 degrees 65 ish during the day and it felt so nice it was like fall weather and now it is just hot and muggy and rainy and humid and I just am not really a big fan of it right now Okay, so I just got back from the grocery store. I didn't end up going to Target. I just went to Publix because, I don't know, I didn't feel like going anywhere else and it was raining. So I just went to Publix, but I have everything like set out so that I can show you guys what I got. I thought that would be fun. Um, this time while I was shopping, since I'm kind of like on this diet or trying to start, I only shopped the perimeter of the grocery store, if that makes any sense. Um, Rachel Radke, she's a YouTuber that I like to watch. Um, she introduced me to that to where you will probably like get more clean items and like food items if you're only shopping the perimeter of the grocery store and not going like in the lanes you know so that's what i did um so everything's kind of like meat and produce i did go into one lane because or one aisle because i needed some seasonings for some of the meat that i got but for the most part, I only shopped the perimeter. And when you do shop the perimeter of the grocery store, it is a little bit more expensive, I find, because I got more like good and clean ingredients and good food items rather than like processed and boxed items. So I'll show you guys what I got. I got a lot of different kinds of lettuce. I got this green butter lettuce, which we have at work. And I was like, I'll try it because I like it at work. So I got one of these. I got an arugula blend. I got romaine hearts, which are my favorite. I really just kind of eat these with everything. And then I just got one head of lettuce. So I have lots of lettuce options for these salads that I like to make. Um, and then I got some asparagus that I'm going to cook. I got, I'm kind of just going randomly. Um, I got four ears of sweet corn that I'm going to make. I got this... This package of diced red onions, I just like blew through the other package I had of this and I literally only had it for like less than a week. I just love red onions and I kind of put them on everything. So I got another package of those. I really like getting this pack so I don't have to like dice up my own onions. I got another package of this goat cheese because I'm kind of like halfway out of the other one that I have and I love goat cheese. I got two packs of these like three trio um, sweet bell peppers. I got one of these the other day and I like also blew through that one so I got two this time. I got two sweet potatoes and fun fact I don't really like like regular mushy sweet potatoes but I will probably like dice these up and like roast them and I do like that. I like roasted sweet potatoes. I got three plums because I like plums and I just saw them and I was like okay that's something healthier that I can get and then fruit wise I got strawberries blackberries and these cotton candy grapes my aunt used to buy these for us at 
when I lived with them and I loved these so I picked these up. I got these smart pockets that I can like make sandwiches in and I got two of them because they were buy one get one free so that was nice. And then I got some dill sauce because I got some like meat that I'm gonna marinate that in. I got some Old Bay because that's just good to have and I also bought some shrimp that I'll um, put on, I'll put this Old Bay on that shrimp. And then I bought some steak sauce because I got some kind of like meat tenderloins or like meat medallions. So I can eat that with that and that's just a good thing to have in your pantry or your fridge. And then I got another package of this Simply Dressed Lemon Vinaigrette. I have like half of this in my fridge but I really like it so I went ahead and got another one. And then I just have some taco seasoning because I like to make tacos and I'll probably like make taco salads because that'll be healthier. And coming over here, this is like the meat that I got this trip. So I got a package of the boneless skinless chicken breasts and I like to grill or like sear this on the stove top. So I really like cooking these. I try and like always have this in my freezer or in my fridge thawing out. And then I got these medium shrimp peeled and divined with the tail off. I'm not really sure how I'm gonna cook these, but I'll figure something out. But I really like shrimp, so I just went ahead and got these. And then I got these beef like petite tender medallions. And I don't really know how I'm gonna cook these, but I think I'm gonna cook these tonight. So I'm excited about these. I'll probably cook half of them and then I don't know what I'll do with the rest. Maybe I'll cook all of them and then just reheat them up when I'm ready to eat them. And then I got this ground chuck, which I like to make tacos with. And then I got some bacon. As you can see, I really just got like produce and meats. So I'm excited about that. And I hopefully will eat clean because of these ingredients. Okay, I'm chefing up dinner right now. I'm making these um, grilled, like, I don't even know what they are, like medallions, <laughs> pork, or these like beef medallions so I'm searing these up right now and then I'm also gonna saute some bacon and some peppers and onions all together and kind of have that all together and then I'm also going to make a little salad as my side dish so hopefully this is good and hopefully I can prove myself and make a good dish <laughs> I'm also I'm also watching Jacqueline Brooks new video on YouTube while I cook Y'all pray that this dinner turns out good, like I'm hoping it will. Okay guys, here's the finished product. So here's the little steak medallions that I cooked up. I might have cooked them a little bit too long, like there's not really much pink left in there at all. I mean, there's a little bit of pink left in there, um, but they're still really good and they're not dry at all. So I'm very proud of my steak dinner creation. And then I just cooked up some bacon and threw it in this salad, so. This salad literally looks so good. I'm so excited to eat it. But I'm just going to sit here for a little while and eat my dinner. It is 5.23 and I need to leave my apartment at like, I want to leave around 6.15. So I'm going to eat this and kind of chill out for a little bit. And then I will leave for rehearsal. Okay, I just got to the church and I'm about to go in. I'm about 30 minutes early for rehearsal. It's 6.30 right now. Um, so yeah, rehearsal starts at 7. Hannah, my roommate, she is in there right now because she is at, um, development, which is like the process that you go through before you get on the worship team. So I'm really excited for her. So I might pop in there and see what they're doing and see if they're still doing development. So maybe I can see her. Um, but yeah, I'm at the church. I'm about to be at rehearsal. I'll probably vlog some at rehearsal too. So you can, so you guys can see that as well. <laughs> What are you uh, doing? I'm vlogging you. You're vlogging? Uh, like, Do you want to be in the vlog? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm being Hello. Serious. Welcome to Robert's Robert's like, like, stay in her room. Let there be freedom. <laughs> Tell him again. Wait, can you give me a countdown? A countdown. I'm being featured. I vlogged my whole day and I forgot to vlog rehearsal, so. Is it on right vlogging, now? Yeah. Vlogging, it's vlogging. Vlogging. I'm gonna start a vlog, so Paul. She swears and she's made like so many. I've made so many, but I haven't edited any of them. Because yeah, I have a real job that I can't. Yeah. I don't have time. No, I but be on the lookout. Wait, yeah, let's hear some. Let's hear some. That'll be um, wedding content. Wedding content, because let's see it. Hey, I'm in the wedding too, so you'll see that. <laughs> okay. Woohoo! I'm gonna play for you with my ring. Okay, with her ring. Oh, wait. Uh, I can't get there. copyrighted because you know that's, hey, that's a thing that not happens from this, to me. Right? Maybe. Ooh. Not from that. <laughs> Hey, all of Gracie's followers, follow me at Morgan Osley. Hit me her on the gram. She's a vlogger. A blogger. I'm a vlogger. She's a blogger. Brayden, do you have something to say to the vlog? You can plug our church. 
Um, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, man, man. This is your life, by the way, if Jenna takes off her yeah, vlogging career. What? Just You're answering this. You're being in front this. of the camera. You guys are going to be a famous couple. Let me say this. Famous I'm not good in front of the camera. I have no idea what to say. Y'all are? And that's okay. That is okay. Yeah. Because the Love Lord has other things. The Lord yeah. loves you, and uh, if you don't believe in him, you <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I'm about to take that out. It's our first time seeing each other, and we are literally besties, but this is the first time. We've been singing on the worship team for a while now, and this, but this is the first time that we're singing with each other. Tender. Tender moments. Tender moments. Bah. 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 All right. Oh, my Yes. Hey guys, so I am home from church now and I'm just about to go wash my face and brush my teeth and get ready for bed. I'm very tired. I just finished up the homework that I had to do tonight, so we're all good there. I got it all done, but I'm about to go get ready for bed and then head on to sleep. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. I know that this content is a little bit different than my normal content, but I hope you guys enjoy it. Comment down below if you want me to maybe do some more of these videos or switch it up and do some different type of videos. Just let me know what y'all wanna see. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. I'll really appreciate it, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.